getting close to the lair, as you can see our friend the anaconda is still closed off. So there's the lair right there. That's where you can see like the amphibians, the lizards, the snakes, the toads. I will say it's mostly snakes and like lizards, since it is the lair after all. There's some tortoises in here. Lots of rattlesnakes. But unfortunately it is closed. It is indoors and during the summertime it does get a little bit humid in there. Well it's supposed to be humid anyway, but it gets even more humid during the summertime. So unfortunately the lair is closed. However, the outdoor section is open, so we can see the animals over here. And this guy's closed off too. In memory of Fred L. Astam, a man dedicated to making the world a better place for children. Big ol' alligator. Or is this a crocodile? You can tell the difference between the two because of the snout. This looks like an alligator. With a crocodile, their, their snout's a lot longer, I believe. We used to have a gigantic alligator many years ago, right in this very spot, actually. Little tiny finches flying around. Got the Tomas, Tommy Stomachs. There's a small one and a big one. I think the big one's over here on this side. Oh, there it is, right there. It's causing some bubbles right over there. So that's the big one right there. One time I saw it underneath this right here but there's a small one right over here as well Whew. so that is the desert layer that's where all the rattlesnakes are unfortunately that's closed off as well here's where they have the terrapin as well as an Indian I can't pronounce this word it's I'm gonna probably slaughter it it's called Garile Garile all rail something like that oh there it is right there Oh, there's another one right there. I didn't see that one. Oh, there's another one. Jeez. Yeah, come on, let's go. Let's go. Look at those teeth. Let's go. There's something moving right over there. It's bubbling. Right there. See where that, there's something like being eaten right there. See right there? Where all those bubbles are? Right there. Oh, it might have just been a fish. No? Something's still, something's still chomping away on that. Is this the line for the restroom? <laughs> the time right now is 2.55. Not bad, actually. Still got some animals to see while we're here, so let's go check them out. So, let's see. We started off here, worked our way around this way, went all the way around. We didn't get to this area here yet, but I went around this way, came over here, got lunch there, and then I went this way. I didn't see the orangutans, but I will at some point today. Saw these guys, saw these guys, now we are right here. So basically we were all around this section, but not this area here. So we're gonna go back up this way and head off to see the tortoises, jaguars, and of course, hippos and tigers. Once again, passing the aviary as well as the carousel. We'll bypass the elephants. We'll probably see them on the way out. Oh, these guys are making a racket. We got the re-fronted macaws over here. Oh, right up there. There you go. He's like giving us a show. He's like, you want to see my feet? And feet. And he's like, da 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 Scarlet Macaw right over here. And they have conversation with each other, obviously. I 
I see some monkeys. Got some capuchin monkeys over here. Running around having a good time in here. Black color monkey over here. I got a squirrel monkey right up here. This neighbor over here is walking around, getting some exercise. He's like, yeah, me too. There's another one right over here. Here's where the giant ant eater is located. Since I get, whoa, there's a big wasp in front of my face. <laughs> and an owl over here on this side. Before I forget, that is a mountain taper right there. Nice. If you look at it from, from the back, it looks like a bear. <laughs> it's not. Oh, it's going in the pool. Oh, it's going in the pool. Or it might be just beginning a drink. I just remember that was an ocelot. Cool. <laughs> There's a manned wolf in here. Oof, boy. That one's a little stinky over here, like a skunk. Oh, I don't see the wolf in here. Oh, wait, no, wait, there it is. Right there in the little makeshift hut right there. Yeah, the sprinklers are on right now, but there's a tortoise shell right up ahead, over there, straight ahead. And it looks like, oh, there's actually another tortoise right there in the, in the water. It's actually moving right now. Its head sticking out right there. It's like, yes, I ordered the shower if I got my soap and shampoo. See the tortoise is asleep, but this guy's awake. I've got the snow leopards in here, and I can actually see a snow leopard for once because for a while I haven't seen one. There it is. across the wooden bridge right now and it looks like this area unfortunately it's not open this is those monkeys that run around like crazy over here another health and safety area it looks like they are going in to get lunch or Leonard the zookeepers has them to come inside there they go here we have the banthas I mean the Takans <laughs> honestly God, they look like like Banthas from Tatooine in Star Wars, don't they? Mm -hmm. 
So even though this area is blocked off, I don't need the animals in here because their signs are gone. The sign holders are blank. At least this one isn't, but... On that side, I guess, but not this side. So in this direction will be the chimpanzees, giraffes, lion, or former lion exhibit, the elephants, the orangutans, and the gorillas and koalas. We've already seen those. Actually, I didn't see the orangutans just yet, so I'll come back this way to see them. But you still need to see the bear, hippopotamus, and tiger. And I'm pretty sure that spot right there was where the rhino picture used to be. So we have the markhor, markhor, parkour, parkour. <laughs> there the, there's the big guy right there. Woo! Look at that mane. It's very obvious who the boss is in this group, right there in the middle. Woo! Don't worry, there's a netting here. These are those monkeys I was referring to a while back where they run around like crazy. There they are. Well, this is the tiger exhibit, but I don't see any tigers. They must be like way in the back or something. And these two have the right idea. Spend the day in the pool. The hippopotamus. There we go. Hippopotami. Their next door neighbor used to be the rhino, but of course the rhino is no longer here. Well, there's actually a taper in here now. Another taper. Well, this used to be the old rhino exhibit, but uh, not anymore. Oh yeah, and by the way, keep a hippopotamus apart. <laughs> keep forgetting there's a totem pole over here by the bear exhibit. Where is the bear? The bear might be in its cave. American black bear. Yeah, it looks like the bear might be in his cape. Oh, looks like he went to the restroom as well. Got a nice little fountain and pool. But no bear. Got a little picture of the bear right there on the side of the cave. Or a mountaintop. This is a dead end. Uh-oh, this is a dead end. Whoops. Well, we just saw these guys. Markor. Hardcore, parkour, you know. <laughs> So we have seen pretty much all of the animals here at the zoo today, except for the orangutans, which we're heading to right now, but pretty much we've seen everybody here at the zoo. All right. That is going to do it for part five of my special October 2020 vlogs right here at the Los Angeles Zoo. I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up button. It is greatly appreciated. Be sure to check out my other videos on YouTube as well as my other channels, the educational series, the Disneyland video series, and the Travel Town series. You can find me on Instagram. The link is down below in the description of this video as well as my P.O. Box address. Thank you so much for watching and seeing, as they say in Hollywood, still not in Hollywood, I'm actually at the Los Angeles Zoo. That, my friends, is a wrap. See you! next time.